I'm going to attempt to tell you a little bit about Bialtana, which is tomorrow. It's an Irish holiday. It's one of four seasonal holidays in Ireland. Uh, I made an Imolig video back on February 1st. This is my Bialtana video. And this is a Maybush, uh, or a, as I call it, a Bialtana bush. And um, this is something that Irish people would decorate. Um, they did it in different ways. The way I did it, um, since it is the beginning of summer, I incorporated seashells and different um, sea items in, in my decorating. Um, as you can see, there is a seahorse on the top. And we have some seashells and some sea stars down here. Um, it's kind of hard to film this and not show you the mess that is my house right now, but I don't care. <laughs> so um, the next little bit that I have here is I decorate with sunflowers. Um, Baltana is a time of year, much like Samhain or Halloween, where the Irish believe that the veil between the other world and this world is thin. And so uh, mystical beings can come through, such as the Tuha Jidanan, which are the Irish gods, well, some of them, um, the fae folk, you know, elves and fairies, mermaids, things like that. So I have a mermaid here to symbolize that. I have all these sunflowers and then I have butterflies here. This is sort of uh, symbolizing the fairy folk. Um, even though in Irish lore, the fairy folk in ancient times were adult size. Um, there are still tales of tiny people and things like that, such as leprechauns and, and uh, the she. Uh, the mound people. So I have that. Um, let's see. I'm gonna <laughs> bypass some junk in my house. We've been helping somebody move. And so um, what I like to do is I like to decorate in golds and yellows for this time of year. We already have a lot of yellow in our house. We have a yellow rug. We got a yellow antelope and a yellow elephant that's on the wall. Um, so I feel that Bialtana symbolizes summer. Um, it's a fire holiday. So there are two main bonfires that people would construct in the old times and they would bring themselves and their cattle through the bonfires as good luck um, on the night of Bialtana. Here I have various yellow flowers. Um, represent this time of year where it's summer. Especially in Arizona, it's very hot. So I think this is a cool thing to do here, um, celebrate with these yellows. So I'm going to move over here. And uh, this is a grass man. Um, in Irish lore, there are many different types of mythical creatures. This isn't necessarily an Irish one, but since this is something that I've had in my house since my boyfriend brought it back from Mexico, we're incorporating this into our Bialtana traditions um, since we are in the Southwest and Mexican culture is abundant here. And then finally, um, at the end here, I have these two plates. They're um, gold. I have two yellow candles on either side. This is representing the two bonfires, and then I have a big old conch shell there, which I think is pretty cool. Um, so at this time of year, um, I'm not doing anything specific for Bialtana, um, just cause we had spent the last week or so helping someone move and we're very tired. But um, you can look online and see various things that you can do for the holiday. Um, it's probably one of the most popular holidays in Ireland, um, the same as Halloween. And remember, it's that time of year when the veil between worlds is very thin. So 
um, protect yourself from any mischievous spirits and such. I want to show you one other thing. So outside. Put this on the door. Again, it's the yellow flowers and such. But anyway, hope everybody has a happy Delta now. Talk to you later.